one day I'll be brave enough to go back to Revengeance. One day. Both Mastiffs really screwed me up big time though. They messed me up hard. I don't know if everyone has like that much trouble with them first time around, but I found them to be pretty tough. Ah, that's what this is for. Neat. Oh, and there's more goodies. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, the Mastiffs really fucked me up. Oh, so there was something back here. Okay, good. Cool. I love the way I totally ignored this, thinking I was super clever. Common material code. Yeah, I don't know what, a bit, what it was about Rising where Ray wasn't too bad. I mean, it's not meant to be hard, he's the first boss, and he, what a fucking strong first boss. Oh no! That was my own hubris there, my bad. Ray wasn't too tough. Um... Yeah, Label, I lost a couple of times on, actually. I don't know if that's normal or if I'm actually just that bad, but... I managed to get past Blade Wolf without fully understanding the parrying, I think. And that's what caused me my problems. Because I should have been a little better at it than I was. Mistral, I think I might have got first try, but that was years ago, so I can't remember. But from then on out, it became kind of rough. Because if you don't understand a game's core mechanic, and like the entire game centers around it heavily, uh, you're going to have a bad time, aren't you? That's exactly what happened. Because I never quite got the hang of parrying. Kind of what happened with Sekiro first time around. There were some bosses I managed to beat fairly easily and others I just had no chance against because I wasn't adept enough at the systems. Never had that problem here though. So I'll probably fix it up in the description. I've got a right before actually we're getting a little close to six o'clock i gotta i gotta finish this session up real quick um second part of file four is meant to be going up um i kind of explained it badly i'm gonna try to fix it up in the description like i was just i cancelled my own thought i guess um oh gotcha what i like about this game is oh no not that I mean, that's my bad, to be fair. I, I finished up in a bad spot. Oh, there was one of you left. Thanks for grabbing it. Gotcha! What I like is... All of this stuff... The attacks and... Oh. Can anyone hear me? Yet? I could use a hand here. So anyway, like I was saying, ignoring that, I don't mind that a lot of this stuff, the combos and stuff, are simplified, and it puts a greater emphasis on using your entire toolkit. That's what really sold me on the game, because I've mentioned I'm not really good at DMC5, I'll be completely honest. What I am pretty good at, though, is playing as V, and I don't know what it is about that kind of style where I'm actually pretty decent. I, yeah, because like, I'll admit, a lot of the stuff I've done with V, what I do with V is not like the proper combos you should be aiming for, and I'm kind of just going off the mentality of, I want my guys to be doing something all the time. Yeah, I want Griffin and um, Griffin Shadow and Nightmare to be constantly doing something. And probably not the best way to play V, admittedly. But in Astral Chain, that mentality works really well because Hit Rush is a thing. I mean, same principle, really. Like, I mean, if I got Beast to do Hit Rush and I was like using Arrow Legion, that's basically Griffin and Shadow, right? Basically, something like that. No spike to stand on for no reason, though. That's one of the coolest things about 5. All the cool shit you can do with V just because. It's almost like the games are about hey, styling. Oh. Can anyone hear me? I'm on my way, mate. On my way. Over here. 
So vulnerable and alone. I know you're out there. I get it, 9S. Shut up. Oh, it's you. I should have known not just anyone would answer the call. My sensors are all blown. So I couldn't tell it was you until I could see you up close. So hey, I kind of need your help finding some missing parts again. What do you say? Help me out for old time's sake? Since my scanners are offline, why don't you use your iris instead and look around? Iris, start up. Hey, iris, shut what do you down. think? Find anything? You know what? Why don't I just check your iris data myself? Whoa, wait a minute. You got the Beast Legion back on its leash, huh? That could come in handy. Take it for a walk and see if it turns anything up. Yeah. It's not like I particularly like bullying the strange drone, but the responses are pretty funny, so I kind of have to at this point. Alright, now one thing I'm definitely going to miss are the secret, dis uh, secret dig spots. I'm not going to bother getting all of them. I don't remember where a lot of them are. So I'm sorry if anyone's disappointed, but I don't think anyone really gives a damn. Missing the cats, however. Something's definitely up with the ground over there. <gasps> Let's have the Beast Legion dig it up. Missing the cats, however, that, that'd be heresy. Organic battery. It's an organic motor drive battery. There's a special fermenting agent inside, but you'd probably rather not know what. Uh, I'm still missing some parts, but I'm not picking up any of them around here. Wait a second. If the Beast Legion can track sounds like a dog and dig like a dog, it should be able to smell like a dog too, right? I mean, track by scent, not, you know, smell like a dog. Come here, Poocher. Please? Thank you. Get him, Lassie. Let's go. What goodies await? I mean, I know where they are anyway. It's kind of obvious. Oh, hold on. These I'm also going to miss. In more ways than one, apparently. Now, I think we have to dig up both for some friends to show up. That's everything. Now bring them on home. Oh, really? Oh, I thought it was the second one, like over there. Guess not. Let's just grab some red matter before the crew show up. Oh, yeah, this is an arena in File 12. I don't remember which one it is, but... Boy, that was a fun mission. The running on platforms bit at the start was also great. Oh yeah, so new mechanic time. One thing I'll have to do is demonstrate something neat you can do while our friend is busy digging. I think there's a second round of this. Ooh, we're getting some low frame rate. Beautiful. Hey, hey buddy. I think there's a round two. Yes, there is. No, you don't. I want to show it off, but if I can bully you a tiny bit first, that's great. I feel like there's going to be an aerial one too, but it could be wrong. Okay, no. I want you to dig. I don't want to kill you yet. I want to show off the cool thing. I had a feeling you're the uh, correct help. So it's not anything super important. Okay, there's our friend. You get used to finding him without the iris. So if you do this, you can actually swap over mid animation. Makes it super easy on Platinum Ultimate, uh, on Platinum Ultimate and some of the File 12 missions. Okay, we just kind of brute force them. 
Oh, you uh, you had problems, did you, bud? Oh, wanted to go for a flip. You know, like Bender, do a flip. Okay, guess what I rank for? I totally forgot. Damn, I I wanted to style a little harder. Hmm. Oh great, that. That's a good time. Collision, how does it work? Yeah, so anyway, um, we're going this way. Reboot complete. Feels great to be back online. But we've got to stop meeting like this. Next time, I'll make it up to you, I swear. It... Hey, wait a second. I'm getting a faint bio signal nearby. Man, the noise in here is crazy. But this signal's definitely human. The Beast Legion must have dragged someone else in before you made it roll over. Time to save the day, huh? Let's go. Okay, we are ranked. Damn. Just a little bit short. Okay. The split pillars. They're not too bad. There's some, uh, interesting ones you find later on, but they're not that bad. More coordination thing than anything. Thing. There we go. You, you get used to it after a while, but yeah, there's some uh, awkward ones where you got to navigate them across moving platforms. All right, speaking of moving platforms, not quite, but close enough. I have probably started running at an awful time. No, okay, this is working okay. Stop here. Okay, I forget how we want to do this. I'm just going to start running now. If anything stops me, it's my own fault. Like that. Damn. Alright, I haven't learned my lesson, so let's just get moving again. Immediately. Yeah, so I'm missing some of this red matter. I don't, I don't really care about. I think it's okay, but we uh, might miss some. But I think we got all of, all of it bar that stuff. Which we can get right now. Awesome. Now, is there anything else around here? Anything hidden? I don't think so. There's something hidden I'm totally missing, but ah oh well. Yeah, so this hasn't come up yet, actually. Hey, 80%, cool. Red mana remover. Cool. Yeah, so we could go back and mess someone up, but I'm, I'm not going to bother for now. Probably do that when we've got the whole gang. You know, Axe and Co. Well, Axe is the only one missing at this point. Now, you're a little hidden item, aren't you? And I know there's a little hidden alcove in a little bit. Just up ahead. Yeah, Arm Legion's kind of slow, but nothing you can do about it by, you know, giving it a ton of speed boosts, or speed star. So actually, what am I talking about? There's many ways to deal with it. Yeah, this is that little alcove, the one that's really easy to miss. What do we got here? Medicine. Let's eat up. This is gonna be a fun one. I mean, we've got something before the fight, but... That's odd. The signal was definitely coming from here. human once <laughs> Jenna. then they were brought here 
to be archived. Someday they'll return to Earth to hunt and bring back others to make like them as chimeras. So this whole place is made of people. How anthropocentric of you. Not only humans, but everything on Earth comes here. The Earth isn't being corrupted, or whatever you might call it. It's being brought here, bit by bit. Or should I say, brought back here. Think of this as a storage unit, kept by unknowable masters. Our extinction is merely their reorganization. <laughs> when you think of it that way, it doesn't seem so bad, does it? What? It doesn't seem so bad? People are... The whole planet is... It's being destroyed! It is. So now what will you do about it? This place is vast. Far larger than planet Earth. Infinite. For all intents and purposes. A tide the likes of which you can't imagine swells before you. How long do you think you'll last against it? But... We have to... By the way... How is the other twin? Still alive then, I take it. That's too bad. I can still remember when I first heard about you two. Twins. Brought into the world right in the middle of the pandemic. As it ravaged Zone 09 20 years ago. Am I mistaken? You were born during the pandemic? Oh, those two are quite famous in scientific circles. The Devil's Children. Born from corruption, they said. If that brave officer hadn't taken you under his wing, you'd probably still be strapped to a lab table. And yet... Yes. You've grown so much. But I... I haven't changed since that day. I'll give you some parting advice. Your power... It's not the blessing you think it is. Be very careful, especially around that man. Take a long look at that. Next is up to you. Shit, she's getting away! Come on, we gotta stop her! Hello? Okay, look, I know that was a lot to take in. There'll be plenty of time to think when Jenna's in handcuffs! Hey, uh, Strange Throne, how do you, uh, know who that is? How do you know who Jenna is? Did you read the script? Nah, there's a sold explanation for it. Yeah, I missed some red matter, I'll get it. Right. So, again. Astral Chain, not a horror game. Not even on par with Bloodborne. But I'm just gonna say... The line of, this is a storage new unit for unknowable masters, that's pretty fucking Lovecraft. I don't know if it was their intention to have that as like, you know, set up for a sequel or two, but holy shit am I ready to fight some Elder Gods in a Platinum game. Anyway, this is going to be a really cool fight, been looking forward to getting here. It also means after this, File 6 is next. Can't wait for a five hour recording session. Six hour potentially, might have to take a bloody break in between. Anyway, this is gonna be sick. You're quite persistent, aren't you? I'd hoped we could keep it to a friendly chat today. I can't let you catch me just yet.
that those Legion Corps are what she stole from the ARI. Let's just ruin all the tension for one sec. We do have enough for something. Alright, real quick. I mean, on the plus side, we get to listen to the sick music, so... Okay, chain drive it is. Assign skill. Sorry if this is, like, at the worst time possible, but we get to listen to the music properly, so that's rad. Which one of you? Oh. I thought we were going to get the stinger, but nah. Didn't uh, do as much as I hoped. Sorry, take a second to check if I had the uh, medicine or not. That's one down. Come on, let's make this cool, alright? Let's see. Ah, uh, damn it. I wanted to see if we could, uh... Hold on, hold on. Let's get some of this back. Also, these are free at this point, so... Oh, damn. I wanted to launch it again and, like, gimp it in the air. Oh, well. Good stuff, team. Fair enough. 650 short. No, oh, well. It's meant to be about 10,000 you get this plus at. Ah, there you are. I've been trying to get a hold of you. How are things going down there? Oh, hey, uh, the civilians who got trapped in the subway are alright. Jenna got away before we could catch her, but... Hey, wait, wait, is that a... Dr drone? H hey, hey, who is this? What are you doing on this channel? Oh, uh, I, I, I'm just a friend. Wait a minute. No civilian should be able to access this channel, and I think I know that stutter. You're from the technical division. How, right? What? I'm not the... <clears throat> Hal who? I'm just... Uh, just an innocent bystander. Okay, now I know it's you. The ace programmer of the technical division, who never actually comes into the office. 
You know, for someone who stays inside all the time, you sure do manage to get in a lot of trouble. Okay, this may be the first you've heard of him, but Hal's one of us. He's a programmer in Neuron's technical division. Neuron snatched him up from high-tech forensics because he can coach circles around everyone else. But, uh, Meat Space isn't really his scene. Most people don't even know he exists. And everyone who does thinks he's a weirdo. So it's nice that you two have made friends. Well, nice for him, at least. Hey, I can still hear you, you know. Aha. So you admit it's you then, Hal? What? No, I... <laughs> I'm just teasing you, Hal. Okay, Alicia's on her way back now. I'll get the details from her. Come on home, but be careful around Hal. His geekiness might be contagious. And Hal, you should come by the station more often, too. Maybe even in person sometime. See you. Is she gone? Man, tough crowd. That was, um... The, the one with the pink hair, right? She seems interesting. <sighs> I guess I better head on back, too. Hey, let me see that data card for a sec. Okay, I've copied over all the data. Here's your card back. I'm thinking we should keep this whole data card business on the down low. I mean, sure, Jenna is crazy, but... I can't stop thinking about what she said. Be very careful around that man. Maybe there's something on this card that'll tell us why. I'll take a look and fill you in on the juicy bits later. All right, we made it. Fall five done. Yeah, so two things we missed. That's Pygmalion and that would be Dryad. B rank overall? Yeah, that's fine. I'll take it. Are we gonna level up? Just. Alright. Well, nothing else to do at this point. Just back out. Cause no way in hell am I recording file 6 uh, right after doing this. Oh great, ice cream truck driving past right now. That's not creepy at all. That's that taken care of. We've got Blade Wolf. Got four out of five legions. Yeah. And we've got one of the coolest chapters coming up too. Sorry, file. Have to differentiate. Um, I was thinking about it. File four is not bad, but I have seen some people say it's kind of like a low point. A lot, of, a lot of important stuff does happen during it, but doesn't feel as eventful as like the start of the game and then it's it's sandwiched between file 3 and this so yeah and Arkham all for as good as a song as it is uh, I guess the level could be a little better but it's not bad by any means I don't think there's any really egregiously bad part in this game the one bit I might call bad will actually be Maybe 40 minutes into file 6. That's inferring I'm going to try to do all the side stuff in Harmony Square first. So yeah, it's that thing after Harmony Square. Anyway, that's enough out of me. We're done here. Thanks for tagging along. See you in Zo uh, Zone 09. Boy, this, that sounded cool. Ugh. Oh, fuck this. i got to stop this recording. See you later.